So this is the OpenStack dashboard with Contrail extension enabled. So let me create a network. Network one, then subnet. So here you have to provide the CID CIDR. Then in subnet details, so I am not going to fill anything here. Okay, this is enough. So let me click on create. Okay, network is created. then go to security group so I'm going to create a security group then add rules add ICMB ingress then add all ICMB egress okay that is enough okay let me add and UDP ingress all UDP egress then add SSH okay then go to instances and launch an instance is vm1 here you can select tennis okay then select the image then go to access and security and select the security group then go to networking so this network is selected if you want to unselect click here it will go here if you want to select you can select like this okay then launch spawning okay vm is created so that is private ip 10.1.0.2 So let me go to that instance so 
So let me log in log into the host machine. So I can log into this VM using this link local address. So let me SSH the VM. Okay, let me access to the VM. Enter the password. Okay, now I am inside the VM. Let me type check the IP address. So here you can see the private IP address 10.1.0.2. So this IP address. So let me add one more network go to networking add one more network network 2 here subnet so here subnet I am going to go turn dot Two dot zero dot zero. Okay. And create. So network two is created. You can check the topology here. So this UI is not working, this topology. So let me do it. Go to instances and create and create a VM in network two. So VM two, this VM two is in network two. So we can send network. Select the image. Security group. Here, select the network. Two. Okay. Then launch. This morning, okay, it's running now. So it got the IP address 10.2.0.2. Let me try to ping to 10.0.2.0.2 from this VM. This will not work see because there is no router in between yeah, there is no router in between these two networks so we have to create a router so go to the routers then create router router 1 create
then select that router then add interface here you have to select first select network 1 and add interface so we connect network 1 to the router with this interface then add one more interface to connect router to network 2 see now ping is not working when we add this interface we can see it start ping okay interface is added now check here see now ping is working so this way you can ping from the vm in one network to vm in the another network so we need a router in between Okay.